Hello, this is Dave and Alka on SV Slacktide. We have been spring cleaning and we are about to move back on board, or we are in the process of moving back on board. I thought I'd give you a look at our quick and dirty cabinetry here. What you see in the longitudinal there, the silvery stuff, that's aluminum angle, 1 8 inch by it by 8 foot lengths, it's pretty cheap. Cut it up. We link it into frames. These are really minimal cedar frames you can see. They're just uh, bolted into the framing of the boat. We screw those sliders in. The drawers have little uh, little buttons on them that are just uh, furniture moving slides and only on the back so you lift the front edge of the drawer slide it in or out and then let it down to be supported there now the only cabinetry of any real sort there is in these uh, these bars let's see if there's a loose one there's one they're just sitting in there they're pretty much ornamental just cut a little notch in there for them to slit in. These could just as easily be screwed or nailed across. They're mostly for looks, and that's the only reason I notched them in. Took the time to do that. Don't always do it, not everywhere, but felt like it here. Now these drawers have lids that slide out. This can be used as a table. Uh, we can pull the drawer out and sit on it. It can be used as a seat. We can use, pull it out partially and use it as a table. We can slide the drawers out. Now you notice that we've never gotten around to adding handles. Many things in our lives remain unfinished. Full of books, this one. Now the way we make these drawers, they're just a uh, half inch top and bottom. See, I'll show you the little slider. There it is. Just a little furniture slider. You can buy those in packs at the hardware store for cheap. Screw them on. The sides are all quarter inch. We just build these together as a cube. And then we saw along this line all the way back. Just saw that off on a table saw all the way around the cube or the rectangle. And then we cut across here. We add lips inside. This is our nav locker. You can see a little lip. Let's see, where's my finger? There it is, right there. This lip, we just add that strip all the way around and that just provides the lip to, to glue portions of it back on. So this back edge is glued on, that's solid. That's solid there solidly glued in and the other part remains open. Eventually one project down the road is to put is to put pins right there in a slot so that can that will stay prisoned. It'll just be a screw going through into a blind slot. But low priority probably never happen. And we add a little trim up front. Add another layer of quarter inch is the face plate. Now these are fairly flimsy drawers in some ways. As you can see, they could not hold a lot of weight. That one's a fairly big drawer, chock full of books. We don't move it full of books. We have to unpack it anyway. I can't lift it anyway easily to get it in and out. And we don't want to torque those too much, but for sliding in and out and sitting on, they're perfectly strong. Uh, on some of them, if they're going to take a bigger load, we might. In the corner here, we've added some trim and just glued that in. That reinforces the corner a little bit. Not all of them have that. If you really wanted to make them strong, you could tack and tape them, tape and glue. But they go really fast, built that way. Just, just a cube, put them on the table saw on edge, saw off the top, put the top back on as you see fit. Eventually, we'll get down to handles. You can see our galley, one of the galley drawers has a handle on it. 
we use that one enough to bump it up in priority. Here's our empty galley. Okay, thanks for joining us. This is Dave Anaka on SV Slacktide.